morning I'm here at Walmart let's head in and do some I haven't shopping been in this Walmart they're changing it all up guys getting it all done different very different from the last time I was here and my grocery list although the bottom part is mostly what I want to look for here at Walmart everything else pretty sure I'm gonna get at we've been finding these Sally Hansen instant dry polishes at the Dollar Tree for a buck 25 $5.98 here at Walmart. Good fun. Little eyeshadow palettes and makeup brushes. Doritos. Cool Ranch. Fruity Pebbles. Flamin' Hot Cheetos. I found some dishes that were very similar to these for about $25. Our Table Landon, I believe, was the brand. These are time and table. These are what, five forty-six. Here's the bigger plates. They're beautiful. I like mine. I got mine for about twenty-five. Three things that were on my list, so I'm gonna go get checked out. First stop was a Walmart. So I'm gonna share with you what I got there. I did spend thirty-nine dollars twenty-one cents. I picked up three things. Two of the items were kind of spendy. The first one is this Bengal Roach spray. Now it's starting to get hot outside. When it's hot outside, the tree roaches tend to want to come in and I want to get ahead of them. $15.68 and this is the big one and it is well worth every penny. 16 ounces. I started using this way back 30 years ago when I still lived in apartments and this would take care of the problem. You know, sometimes when people would move in and out of apartments, you begin to get roaches. This works really good. And then here, since um, it's getting to be summertime, it's getting hot, the roaches will, the tree roaches will try to start coming in. So I want to get ahead of them and get this spray down and just keep them out um, of the house. Tree roaches have, um, if it gets really cold, they try to come in. And if it gets hot, they try to, <laughs> they try to come in as well. I was choked. Next is this Waverly White Wax. I need this for uh, something I'm working on. And it was $7.27. So I got that. And I needed some new mascara. Yeah, this was $13.27. So it's a two-pack. Well, I guess really everything that I got at Walmart was kind of spendy. But anyway, next, let's head to H-E-B. And then we'll meet right back here and I'll share with you what I purchased there. Here at H-E-B, let's head in and buy some groceries. My grocery list, well thought out and bland. Uh, you gotta get everything here at H-E-B. Here's my to-do list on the back of my grocery list. And I've been knocking things out this week getting all my stuff done. The Panera bread dressings and the Chick-fil-A dressings. Garden herb, creamy salsa, and avocado lime ranch. What you can do to the and the lady was giving us clotted cream. And I looked it up. I'm going to try it one day. Not this week, but Sunday. I'm going to buy that and give that a try. I think it goes on scone. Lily's brand products, like in candy bars. I've never seen these. I'm sure they're not new, but they are new to me. I like the Lily's uh, chocolate chips. They're really good. I might have to try this one. It's almost a dollar off. Salted almond chocolate style. At the Dollar Tree for a buck 25 for some like lemon ends. Always check. Ollie's first before buying them at these prices. A lot of times Ollie's has their M&M's on clearance for cheap. I've gotten them as low as a dollar for this sharing size. And I know the Ollie's expiration dates are really close, but I've eaten them well way past the expiration date. I mean, as long as they're sealed, I think they're good. I've never had a problem with any of my all these m ms even if the date was like even past due they've been like still to good. do the um drink flavor packets i like to use these 
these uh, sparkling waters. It's zero calories, zero sugar. Let's get the sweet and lime. It's kind of like a Sprite. And then it's also kind of a plain base for your different drink packets. Here they have them for 78 cents. I've been getting them at Dollar General just because it's convenient, but they are a lot cheaper here at the grocery store. You can usually get about two or three of my Yeti cups using this because I do use this and water and then you know of course the ice to make my drink. hauling these halo top little cake mixes at the Dollar Tree. If you see them grab them. They're $2.48 here at the grocery store. These are the Dollar Tree which is usually where I get them at just pure convenience but they are a dollar at the grocery store been at the dollar tree for about 25 they're really my groceries for the week i didn't get much i didn't need much but i did have some very specific things on my grocery list that i wanted to purchase so let's head to the register and get checked out and i'm home so I'll share with you what i got i spent let's see 73 dollars 16 cents and i got some some groceries I, I was thinking back i was trying to remember how long it's been since i did a grocery haul i really think that i've really done just two this year i think so like legit groceries i've gone you know like to dollar general and picked up a few things but to say i bought groceries no i don't really don't think i have not maybe twice so I'll hop right in. I'll share with you what I got. I got the Gordettos. They had the family size for $2.96. So they have a smaller one at Dollar General, which was $2.49. This one is the really big one. And we're going on vacation in a couple of weeks. So those are great snacks. I can, um, you know, divide them out. We'll have them. And um, that was a really good price. I got another thing of Clorox, a small one. I didn't write the price on this because I may not need it. Uh, $3.98. So I got that just in case. I shared with y'all in the store these sparkling waters. 78 cents. Zero calories, zero sugars, no sodium, no caffeine. It's uh, three servings per container, 12 ounces. And I use these to make like flavored waters with. And so I'll use some of this, some of water, um, some water. Anyway, I like the, the carbonation is what gets me. I love a uh, fountain Coke. I love the carbonation. So that, that gives me the little um, fix, I guess, that I'm looking for. These are the ones that I get at um, Dollar General. The one I got at HEB. This one is like, a, I don't know, it's, it's more than a dollar. But I can't remember the exact cost. Same difference. But I just happen to be at HEB. And they're cheaper there. If I wasn't at HEB, I would be fine buying it at Dollar General for their price. I did get one of these Lilies. Um, I wanted to give it a try. This one was on sale less sugar sweet life salted almond almond milk chocolate style so i want to give that a go got some tortillas i want to make fish tacos which i already have my fish defrosting this was 288 you get 20 tortillas i believe i'm not sure where i got this maybe aldi no a kroger so I packaged it up with my vacuum sealer. I did this back in November. I'm just gonna defrost it, it's tilapia, and I eat that. Make some fish tacos. Got some coleslaw, I love coleslaw on my fish tacos. So $1.68, and then when I was at, Walmart, at Dollar Tree last time, I picked up this coleslaw mix that I wanna try. I love coleslaw i really like homemade coleslaw i thought i would give this a try i'm hopeful that it's good i like to make my own slaw dressing um got some wipes. i i use these guys uh, you get three packs for 360 i mean for 677 
and uh, it's 192 wipes. So I got those. Sour cream, 248 for the big Daisy sour cream, one pound. Haven't had bananas in a long time. So I got these. These are a little green, but I know they'll they'll ripen soon. Uh, they were $1.17 for six, and these are a little bit smaller bananas. Sh shared with y'all, wanted to give this a try. This Core Power High Protein Milkshake is 26 grams, and it's chocolate flavored. I usually been buying protein at the Dollar Tree. I just wanted to give this one a try. It was $3.28. I did get two of these um, that, let's see. I did get six of these, so I'll have them here in the house. So there's that. Next is a, a meal that I want to make in the next couple of days. I, wanted, I got some ribeyes. I love ribeyes, and uh, they had uh, three of them for $23.34. I might have could have got them cheaper had I went to Kroger, but I don't want to be out running around. So I got that. They had their uh, they had some of their mushrooms half price, so a dollar seventy four. I can do some sauteed mushrooms. They had shallots, chopped shallots, for a dollar forty nine. They had asparagus, so good, $1.88. And I got a little thing of the cherub tomatoes. These were $3.48. So I will eat them out of the container for a while. And then I'll put them in the freezer. I just freeze them and uh, you can use them in, you know, if you're making Spanish rice, if you're making any kind of soup or, you know, anything where you would normally throw some tomato in. You can use these. They work perfectly. But that is it, guys. I'm looking around, make sure I didn't miss anything. Let's open up this real quick. Let's give it a go. I love the Lily's um, chocolate morsels. So I think this will be good as well. Here it is. Let's see. Let's see what it says. Three servings per, three servings per bar. 130 calories, less than one gram of sugar. Here it is. Let's give it a go. Let's see what it's all about. Mmm. Definitely not a Hershey's candy bar, but it's not bad. Mm. I think I would rather have a Hershey's candy bar than this. Anyway, guys, just my honest opinion. One thing about it, when you start eating something, you got to finish it. So, it wasn't too bad. It wasn't the best. I think if I was going to eat chocolate, I'd rather just eat a real piece of chocolate. Anyway, mm, I don't know. I think the morsels are better. Maybe this, let me see, is this milk considered? No, I mean, it says it's milk chocolate style. It tastes more like a dark chocolate. Anyway, guys, that is it. That is all for today. Hope you've enjoyed this video. And if you have, please give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button down below. Become part of my friends here on YouTube. And I will see each of you in my next video. Bye, guys.